morning and win today. Win today. Win forever in Jesus' mighty name. Children of God, you are welcome. May God bless you for listening. May God open all the doors that were closed. Closed by wicked, evil spirits, forces of darkness, principalities. You are welcome. I love you, children of God, with the love of God. Subscribers, I welcome you. New subscribers, those who were just passing and see this uh, page and it's your first time, kindly subscribe. May God bless you, bless you while you listen. Please, child of God, subscribe. Children of God, let's pray the word of God by giving others, sharing the link so that they can subscribe. What you want from God, they also want it. They don't want darkness. They're tired of uh, darkness. They are tired of being tortured by demons. They are tired about enemies trying to pull them down. They are tired about everything that you are tired about. So children of God, share it. Give it to them. So that they can also pray with it. And listen to our Father. Our Father is the Word. Our Father is the one that speak with us. Speak with me and you. So children of God, let's share it. Let's share it. And God will bless you because by sharing, you are winning souls. Uh, once you, you win only one person, one soul. In heaven, it's like millions. And heaven rejoice for you. And then rewards and breakthroughs are coming. So children of God, let's win souls by sharing the page, the link, and advise people when they have problem. After you got your problem or your deliverance, do not forget others who are suffering. Show them, tell them that I met Prophetess Ruth. This is what she did. Try her. And when she try, she'll also win because to try is to teach the person how to behave uh, in order to conquer everything. Open the heart. Allow Jesus Christ to fill your heart. Do not, do not, I say do not again. Take all the mistakes and remember all the flaws that we have. We have all, each and every one, child of God. Remember we're in dark. We're doing a lot of evil things. Don't even remember that. You must know that the day you said, God, I follow you, he forgave you. He forgave you. So same to others and you, more importantly, because you are following him. Don't even listen to that voice of Satan. When Satan reminds you to say, remember, this husband of yours is nonsense. In, you know, when you, after you're married, uh, you find this as a evidence that he's uh, cheating. Tell Satan that, Satan, my husband is no longer like that. Go away. And when he come back and say, hey, remember your, your fiancé, your partner, he, he cannot marry you. You remember you saw something in his, in his photo. Tell him that, Satan, I love him the way he is. I'll pray for him. Go away. That's how you must conquer this evil one. He's so evil. What he knows is to destroy relationship, health and stuff. Telling people when he put all these afflictions with HIV, with incurable disease, with cancer, what he does, he just say, hey, you know you'll die. It's a voice. Hey, you know. Tell him that I'll not die. This body is a temple of Jesus Christ. Sinner prophet Tim Joshua says, I quote, a person might have a dangerous disease, but be a favorite of God. Those diseases is not meant to kill you. No, it's to draw you closer to him. One day you'll wake up when you go to the doctor. They say it's gone, you don't have. And then you ask yourself why. It was not meant to kill you because you are a child of God. You are a seed of Abraham, a descendant of Jacob. No evil shall befall you. Tell devil that stop reminding me nonsense. Get out. My body my inside and out belongs to Jesus. My body is a temple of Jesus Christ. Yes, remind him also that, children of God, that's what is needed. I welcome you the way I love you. <laughs> I love you, you know. You know I love you. I, I love you. I don't know how to put it, but I love you. 
And when I pray for you, ne, I, I, I will pray for you, pray for you. Then uh, when I finish, then I say, oh my God. I pray for my, 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 my sheep, all of them. On my group, on YouTube. And then I pray for my family. And guess what? I forgot to pray for myself. <laughs> when I love people, I'm like, uh, when I love people so much, I do that. I pray for you more than myself. That's how I do. Because I don't want any evil to befall you. I don't want it. I'm praying. I cry to God that God, someone asked me at work, not long, because it's not long I left the job, and asked me, mm, eh, you know, Ruth, I thought that um, you must go and see a voice therapist. Then I look at the, the, that woman, and then I smile. And then I laugh. I say, hi, this one, uh, it's like this. I inherited my father with a very big voice, huge voice, like uh, the vocal cords. Is, uh, and uh, I inherited my father's structure. And uh, um, me and the boys, when we were together, you think that because the one that come after me, all boys, I'm the last one, a baby in the, in the girls, after the girls. And then the, the, the baby sister. So I said, I took everything about my father and I was my father's uh, a favorite because he always, even when he, his last days to pass, because he was not sick, he, he was fresh and he was still young. He was next to me, following me wherever I was around me, not knowing that he wanted to tell me that, Baba, <laughs> I'm leaving. Because when I came back to job, it didn't take a uh, first month and then nearly when I started the second month and he passed on. So the voice, I told the, the, that lady that the voice is like this. And others think that it's, so, it's not so. It's the way it is. It's so heavy. Like my niece says, when she she first uh, checked, she was checking on YouTube who to pray with. And then she found, when she listened, she found a huge voice like this. And she said, yo, how are this one is too huge. I don't want this voice because I'm tired of it. It's like my mom. And then a, a, a voice told her that in that heavy voice, you have to listen it. Listen to it. And then now she's my, she's no longer my niece. She's my attachment. <laughs> so it starts there. And sometimes it's, it's, it's how it is. It should be. And even, uh, like I said, that I took all more from my father. All the genes, tall, body slender, everything. Then all my sister's short and my other brothers like ma so me and my three brothers we took it from my father so wherever I'm, wherever they're around me whenever they're around me and then we're speaking i'm i'm even huge like them with a the voice uh, uh, <laughs> so don't mind my voice but if now and uh, now devil use it as um he used it uh, a avenue as an avenue that when I hit more demons, then it will go down. I know that if I deliver someone, and even if I didn't scream, then he, he goes straight to my voice and attack my voice. But the Holy Spirit, because it's God, after a few hours or the following morning, the voice is back. Uh, so you must pardon me where sometimes you don't hear me say, Ish, that this voice, it's your prophet who oh, she was born like that. It's the the grace that God gave me and the gift. <laughs> so children of God, I just love you. I love you. I can't wait that God give us a grace to to to, to, to have those um um uh, 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 altar is there. We have two the two Places that you can choose and make an altar in the house. It's only there, there to, to, to buy everything, machines, and then put a big screen. And then I know that 2023, we will get it. We will get it. Remember, children of God, everything starts from small. That's why Senior Prophet Tim Joshua's church started with 10 people. Now it ended <laughs> with, I don't know, 
uh, because we won't count those who are attending church that you see every week. We are, we are counting those who see about 28 viewers, 28K viewers and 30 viewers and 76 viewers that are viewing all over the world. So it all starts from small, but in the mighty name of Jesus will grow. Children of God, I still love you. So now we have give, been given a word. It's Tuesday. You are blessed. A word. It's in the book of 1 Peter 5, verse 5. That is Apostle Peter who was speaking there. So children of God, I call you now that you must just uh, open your heart while we read the word. Open your heart. Listen attentively. And when I'm done, go to the script. There's one girl, this girl, I supposed to have prayed for her. She's supposed to, when she, when she was in need of deliverance, she ended up not getting deliverance because of her problems. And then she decided that she would just go straight to the YouTube channel. She followed me, she, she subscribed, she followed me. She prayed with me, with us. Every video that I put, she'll download and pray. So God is, I, I, I pray that God must give him more and more strength because God is with her. A breakthrough will come like that. Because why? I'm inspired about her faith. She, she, she was never prayed for. She was never delivered. But because of her faith, she read the word more. I don't say that you are not reading. I'm trying to, to praise her. That God has given her wisdom. He has given her wisdom to say, do this and do this. Even if, you know, our faith must uh, uh, is, are not the same. Let us believe like this. and that. So by just connecting, and when we go to fasting, she go to fasting. To the extent that she even <laughs> tell others that I wish it could have continued. Because it's a faith. A faith is so strong, and with that faith like that, she'll go far. She doesn't believe on deliverance only. She believes on the heart and faith, and that what is impresses God most, the heart, the heart. So, children of God, I love you. All the prophets of God, I salute you with the love of love. My pastors, mama, single all the prophetess, they know themselves. I love you. May God open your eyes to see invisible. Mm. I love you all. My, fam my, my, my sisters from the single families, all the church, I love you all. Protocol observed. I love you. And I will never stop to love you for the support. The way you are supporting this channel, this channel is going for six, seven months now, but the way you support it, it's like as if it started a long time ago. May God bless you all. And you are alive. Bo prophetess Mkalipule, Louisa, Bo prophetess, prophetess Lucetta, all of you. God loves you. My daughter, Mabaso, in Cape Town. You are highly loved. God loves you too. I love you all. My niece keep on winning souls. She knows herself. When I say my niece, she knows. <laughs> I told her that <laughs> they will chase her at church because she's taking all the link and the numbers and give it to all the people at church. I love you, all of you, Koti, with your nice names. Koti, I love you all. May God bless you. And those that I don't know, I know you. <laughs> spiritual I can see you may God bless you and don't doubt even those who are doubting that I wonder well, God what is going on with this uh, 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 woman continue to listen to me God is using us mightily hmm? continue to listen and pray and download I love you children of God and then let's listen to the word after the word we'll do the prayer it's a book of First Peter 5.5 5. You have to read it attentively, slowly, and repeatedly. That's how our mentor said it's in a prophet Joshua. You don't be don't go in a hurry. Word by word. 
Then it will be like engraved in your heart so that you can meditate with it. Because the word is sharper than the double-edged sword. The minute you, you speak and read, you are connecting with your Father God, the creator of heaven and earth. Thank you, Jesus. We acknowledge you, Spirit of the truth. So, Father God, we thank you. Our Father in heaven, Jesus. Christ of Nazareth, Spirit of the truth, my God, my Lord and God. We appreciate you. We acknowledge you. Thank you for the word that you spoke that we have to read. Thank you for giving me. As I ask you, be prior, I preach, and you tell me where to read. Thank you, Holy Father, for your teachings. We love you. Come and descend. Fill their houses. Fill their places. Fill their head to two. Fill them. These are my sheep. Touch them. Let them feel the change in their body flu system. The light of God inside out. Break the yokes. Thank you, Jesus. Change the heart. Open the heart to receive. Let the word stay inside the heart. Fill our heart, Holy Spirit. Touch us. You are deliverance and that bear the marks of the nails. Touch each and every one of my sheep. We love you. We adore you as we read the word. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, my God. Thank you, Holy Spirit, our Father. You are loved. Amen. It reads us, um, First Peter, there. Before all revelation, first Peter, you know, it's all about Apostle Peter speaking with us as disciples. Disciples are, who are children of God, and me and you, who said will carry the cross. First Peter 5 from this 5. Likewise, you younger people, submit yourself to us, your elders. Yes, all of you be submissive to one another, not only to adults. To other to our, uh, elders only, but yes, submissive to one another and be clothed with what humility. God resists the proud, but give grace to the humble. Therefore, humble yourselves under the mighty hand of God that He may exalt you in due time. Not now. In due time. When you do what? You humble yourself. Humility. Invite humility when you pray. Be submissive to one another. To call someone when you pass says good morning. You don't just help people that you know. A person who has a problem assist him or her if it's possible. Respect your elders. Humble yourself to them, young ones, so that in due time, God may exalt you. In due time, that mighty hand will exalt you. That is why Sina Prophet TV Joshua like the elders helping them. Let's help them. We mustn't curse them. But help them so that our reward can come mightily in due time. Casting all your care upon him, for he cares for you. He cares for who? For you and me. Be sober, be vigilant, because your adversary, the devil, walks about like a roaring lion, seeking whom he may devour. Why Apostle Peter talk about humility, submissive, and they're now speaking about the adversary, the devil that walks in room around like a lion, seeking who to and a to devil, because God doesn't want a person who lack. Humility. Who doesn't want to be submissive? Who doesn't want to humble him or herself in his eyes? We have to invite Holy Spirit to say, Father, I, I like those children of God, like I said before. I said prior that I like it. I have to pray and ask him prior doing God's work long time ago that he must humble me. 
after repeatedly when they were telling I was uh, sorry when I was told wherever I go to the churches that they would pick me up and say this one you must sin under my name she's so loving by God God want to use her then I said oh no wonder now I start to prevail everything that happened to me and then I started to I invite God to humble me that even today, my son will always ask me that my heart is so because people do shout at you. You don't answer, ma. You don't, you, why you don't retaliate? Then I'll say, my God and my Redeemer liveth. He knows. Let them continue. But my Father who's in heaven will reward me. It's very painful because you won't sleep and your heart will be pumping high. But just invite calmness. And then calmness will come and humility now will start to grow. Resist him, Satan. Steadfast in the faith. Steadfast in the faith, in the faith knowing that the same suffering that our father has experienced. Uh, sorry, that the same suffering that, that experienced by your brotherhood in the world. Yes, resist him, who oh, Satan, who's roaring to, to devour the children of God. Steadfast fast in the faith, knowing that same sufferings I experienced by your brotherhood in the world. Meaning all the body of Christ, meaning all the children of Christ. We attract the demons, remember. People hate us without doing any wrong to them. They look at you and hate you. They don't hate you spiritually. They hate what is inside you. They, you, they, their demons become resist, like, like violent by looking at you. They, you bore them. They curse you. They hate you. They can dent even your image. Because of what? What is inside you? Remember, you are a descendant of Abraham. Of Jacob. A descendant of Jacob. And you are a seed of Abraham. You share your body and your blood with your father Christ. Holy Spirit is in you. So imagine a person who's dark and evil. He must hate you or she must hate you or your children without a cause. So that's where it ends, children of God. From verse 5 until verse 9. It's very short. You repeat it, read it attentively and slowly. Submissive and humility. You have to close yourself with that humility. They must know you by your behavior, your actions. Is that one when we swear, she just say it is well and pass, like a, a Shunammite woman, knowing that inside there's a pain. But she just passed and said, well, after you swear, you go and dent the image. Uzenza non. Hoyomutu, hey, she thinks she's best. I don't like her. Without a cause, I don't want to see them. But there's no reason. Once you hear that, shoot more. Go, we fight using knees. Go in your knees and cry. Invite God, you will see what will happen to that person. Yes, God says, don't touch not my anointed one. Do not do harm to my prophets, my prophets and my anointed one. Meaning, anointed one and all the prophets, we cannot touch them. Do not do harm to them. He monitor us, the book of Psalm 11. So we thank you, Master Jesus. We thank you, Holy Spirit. Children of God, let's close our eyes and pray. Open your heart. Touch whatever you want to touch. Invite your Father, the living God, to fill your heart. Invite him. Touch whatever you want to touch. 
In the mighty name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, Holy Spirit, we invite you. Spirit of the living God, ye are your children, Lord. Touch them, Holy Spirit. Touch them, descend, Holy Spirit. Their houses, their bodies, from head to toe, Lord. Touch them, Ebenezer. They are so Father, thankful because you carry them. You carry them until December. Now is December. And they know that Holy Spirit, they shall not die. No one shall die in their families. No one shall die. They know that, Lord, you cancel premature death that the enemy was planning. You cancel, Lord Jesus, all the harm and danger, accidents on the road, because, Lord Jesus, you love them. My Father, I invite you, Lord, to wash their eyes, wash their eyes, their wisdom, wash their eyes, their hearts. Connect them. Connect them with the Holy Ghost. Connect them with the blood and wash them. To say invisible, to say dreams and dreams, visions and visions. Speak with them, Holy Father. Speak with them, mighty God. You are deliverance and Lord of the law. Oh, Father, break the linkage of all bondages, blockages in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Father, fill their heart, their heart. Fill their heart, Spirit of the truth, my God. Release our son as Jesus Christ to live and make the heart their dwelling place, his dwelling place, his resting room, in order to control them. Father, because they are no longer living their own life, my Jesus, they lead the life of the one that died for them. Who's that? Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Holy Spirit, fill them. Abba, Father, fill their heart, Lord, fill their heart. Break the linkage, the yokes. Break the linkage, the yokes darkness, all the evil monitoring demons, monitoring spirit, the spirit of killing, stealing and destroying, come out from them your darkness, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, the book of Psalm 18, 44 to 45, as soon as they hear my voice, as soon as they see me, they have to obey in the mighty name of Jesus Christ Holy Ghost, fire destroy Holy Ghost, fire destroy you ancestral spirit you ancestral spirit you are the cause, because because you are generational curses. Let the children of God, these ones, they have been chosen. These ones are like the Israelites. These ones in that door, there's a mark of the cross of the blood. Therefore, even in their forehead, you darkness, I have to remind them, even in their forehead, they bear the marks of the Lord. That is the cross that was made by the Israelites on the doors of the houses. Therefore, they bear on the forehead of their faces. Therefore, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, your darkness, familiar spirit, generational curses, your bondages, I know you are in the same clan. Therefore, release them. I command you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, the name that is above every name. Come out in their lives. Get out in their lives. Holy Ghost, fire, come out. Holy Ghost, fire be broken. Come out wherever you are hiding. Wherever you are following them. Wherever you are busy blocking them. Whatever you are doing to them. You follow them. Your ears are all insects. All kinds of insects to come and listen. And take every plan that they are planning. And God deliver it to the kingdom of darkness. Come out, Holy Ghost. Fire, fire. I break your linkage. Out in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I command you by the authority. Authority. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, the name that is above every name, leave them bondages, your generational curses. I'm still talking to you. In your kingdom, you are ever wicked altars. Wherever you have connected them, wherever you have marked them, and say these are mine, you will never have them. They belong to Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I break your linkage. Be disconnected. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I command you now, come out of them, out. Come out in their lives, their children, their families, out. Come out in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Be total destroy. I break your linkage. Come out in their eyes. Come out in their brain. Out in their faces. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I break that linkage. That you link with them. In their brain. In order to control them. You use your wicked evil gadget to control them. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Be broken. Holy Ghost, fire, fire. Come 
out, I command you. Out in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Lose your grip. I break your grip. Lose your grip. Your generational curses. Your familiar spirit. Your bondages I'm speaking to you. Come out from the children of God. Release them. They are taking what belongs to them. And as the end of the year, they will never carry that poverty. That's taking They will never carry that financial constraints. You stole their finances. You bring all the stagnancy. Get out in their lives. You release all your wicked evil tortoise in their yards in order to make everything go slow. Their evil snails so that they must come and come and harm in order to steal their finances, their breakthrough and prosperity. Holy Ghost, fire, come out, take all your familiar spirits that you put on the yard let it be exposed and die you know whatever you put in the houses and the ceilings on the foundation of your bondages get out from them I command you in the mighty name of Jesus Christ I break your linkage I destroy you you ancient dragons operating from the family ancient dragons operating in the kingdom of darkness as generational curses as familiar spirit as bondage Bondages. Come out in their in their lives. I send the call of fire. I evolve the power of the ghost. The power that parted the sea. The power that was given to Moses. I scatter and destroy. Using the staff that was given to Moses. Using the double-edged sword of my father. Fiery double-edged sword. I cut those linkages. I cut those chains. I cut internal external chains. Secret seeds. And all that you hide them inside. I break those soul ties. That you put into them. That they shall never marry. That you'll control them through gadget. Using the old photos. Using the wicked evil parts. As witchcraft. And your evil mountains. Your evil altars. Using and calling their names. I break the linkage. That you whisper inside their ears. Not to hear. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Arise God of Abraham. God. God of Papa Abraham, God of Papa Elijah, scatter, destroy. My Jesus Christ, you have given us authority by the authority that you gave it to me, that you bestow on me, Lord. I scatter and destroy and divide every challenge that is emanating from my children's life, Lord, coming from spiritual husbands as ancestors, very spiritual husbands, as ancestors, spirit from the waters, spiritual husbands, spiritual wives, coming from generational curses that father was caused by our forefathers more foremothers not, not knowing Lord they were in the dark have mercy on them they didn't know Lord release our children I break the linkage your spiritual husband spiritual wives come out in the body flow system be total destroy Holy Ghost fire in our linkage your bondage Holy Ghost fire wherever you connect come Come out from the child of God in the brain, on the shoulders, in the balls, the flow of the system, on the brain, the back of the head. It's always pound when you connect. Holy Ghost, fire, I break your linkage on the back of the head. Come out from the children of God on top of the right breast. Holy Ghost, fire, fire, I break your linkage. Come out, I disconnect you. Lose your grip. I break your linkage. Lose your grip. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, come out. Below the left the brass ah, where there's a pancreas where you put all your noses carry all your load your satan your spiritual husband your spiritual wives fire fire I break you loose get out of them you feed them and you make idol food you feed them at night because you initiate them fire on your altars fire on your content or because fire I break that linkage come out your darkness your wicked bondages wicked generational curses release the children of God come out from them in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, what oh, because fire on top of the left breast or on the below the left breast come out, out in the stomach. Now we go to the stomach on the navel where the navel is because you have stolen all the umbilical cord in those years and you mark them because their mothers and their forefathers were busy praying all the cause they didn't know. Get out, your ancient gods. 
Holy Ghost, fire as ancestral spirit. I break your linkage. Let this one. This one has made a covenant with our Father Jesus Christ. Release them. The mighty name of Jesus Christ. Holy Ghost, fire, fire. Come out, I command you. The mighty name of Jesus Christ. And the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Holy Ghost, fire. Fiery rain, fall down. Holy Ghost, fiery rain, fall and disconnect. Any linkage of ancestral spirit. Because my father, they were busy practicing the gods, not knowing that the generation will suffer because of the cases. Wherever you're hiding or linking through the foundation, all the tunnels of the foundation, connecting to the children of God in the houses, there are certain places when they Pass, and then there's a linkage. You link them through the tooth. You link them through the bones under the sole of the feet. It's itching. And when they itch, they don't know. You enter, you serpent. Your spiritual husband. You ancestral spirit. Fire in your crown. Fire in your eyes. What goes fire in your ears? What goes fire in your nose, your mouth? What goes fire in your tongue? Fire in your stomach? What goes fire in your tail? I break you loose. The light of God to destroy you. I invoke the double fire of the Holy Ghost. Rainy Holy Ghost fire. I burn your crown. The mighty name of Jesus Christ. Come out and lose your grip. Leave the children of God. This one has been taken. Now you bow into them. You bind them and you bound them. Not to prosper. You bound them. That every year is stagnancy, is backwardness, is limitation. Release them. Be broken. Come out from their lives. Out to darkness. Out to bondages. Release our finances. Release our breakthrough. Release our destiny help us. Destiny help us. Locate my sheep. Destiny help us. Locate the children of God. Destiny help us. Locate my sheep. They are waiting for destiny help us. Favor upon them. Locate them. Destiny help us. No blockages. Fashion against you shall blossom. Come and locate my people. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Lion of tribe of Judah, he was set on the Father's throne, the King of glory, the coming Messiah. You are deliverance and Lord, touch my people. Release, Lord. Father, hear their cries. Their heart are crying. Their heart are yearning, Lord. They want you, Lord. Father, Lord, break the blockages that Satan has divided them, not to connect with you. And more wisdom to overcome darkness. Your flying serpents, flying wicked, evil dogs. Dogs, flying insects, biting them, polluting them with diseases and viruses. What goes fire in your tentacles, your teeth? What goes fire? I break it, I burn it. What goes fire? Break you. I say, Lord, I curse you. And I curse you dry up and with out in their bodies, out in their flutes. Come out in the mighty name of Jesus. I command you. Out in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I declare. And the power, the power that opened the tomb, the power that parted the sea, the power that raised Lazarus from the dark. I said every dead organs, every dead marrow, dead blood, dead veins, dead brain, yes, every dead tendons, dead wrist of the hands and fingers, dead of the tooth, the bones, every dead cells, you dead marrow. Arise in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Be awake, I command you. Be awake. Be fortified. Be resurrected. Resurrect. Hey, be awake. Be fortified. Come back to life. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. The light of God. The light of God to search and destroy every stubborn demons. Stubborn ancestral spirit. Operating in the waters. I break your linkage. Come out in our lives. Out, Holy Ghost, fire. Come out in our lives. In the mighty name of Jesus. Come out in thy children's lives. Out. I break your yokes. Come out, I destroy you. Secret says, with all the evil cages that you get, that they cannot move forward and back. The light of God. I break your linkage. I break your grip. Lose your grip. Release them. I, I set the freedom. I declare freedom. Be free. And the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Be free.
and the mighty name of Jesus be resurrected and the mighty name of Jesus Christ your spirit of stealing all their businesses you steal their businesses you hide it under the darkness and you are called and you are evil altars you hide in their businesses that they mustn't know be known they mustn't guard destiny help us you hide all their finances their businesses their contractors that they mustn't win it you are darkness you are wicked i curse you release everything fire in your wicked evil hands or it goes fire in your claws fire in your kingdoms or it goes fire in your coven fire in the mountains where you operate fire in the evil forest under the mountains in the waters bermuda island where you operate second heavens or it goes fire fire i evoke double fire I break all the linkage. I break whatever you connect them. Lose your grip. Come out. Leave the children of God. Wherever you are operating in the deep waters, wherever you are operating in the seas, connecting. Holy Ghost, fire the light of God. The light of God, wherever you are operating. Holy Ghost, fire the light of God. The light of God, I break your linkage. Release the children of God. Let there be light to their businesses. The light to their contractors. Let there be light to our finances. Release our finances. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Father, search and destroy from here to two. Rainy Holy Ghost. Fall down. Rainy Holy Ghost. From here to two. Rainy Holy Ghost. On the spinal cord and the shoulders. Rainy Holy Ghost. On the waist, the fluid. Inside the stomach, the chest, the lungs, the kidneys. Rainy Holy Ghost. On the flu, the blood, the blood. Rainy Holy Ghost. The cells, the waist, the knees. The knees that locks. The knees that locks. Rainy Holy Ghost. Under the, under the feet. The knees, the toes. Rainy Holy Ghost. The big two. I break your linkage. Be broken, you Satan. Rainy Holy Ghost. Search and destroy. The mighty name of Jesus Christ. Rain the Holy Ghost fire. Search and destroy. I cut it off. Release the children of God. And the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I be awake, dead organs. Dead finances. Locate the sender. The mighty name of Jesus Christ. Dead prosperity. Dead destiny. Future. Arise from the deep darkness tunnels of Satan. Arise and locate the sender owner. And the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Glory. Locate your owner. Anointing. Locate your owner. What are you doing? In the kingdom of darkness. Arise and locate the owner. The fire of the Holy Ghost. God's hand to resurrect it. Locate the owner. Dead prosperity. Blockage not to do God's work. Arise. Be revived. Be revived back to the owner. And the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Search and burn, Lord. Search and burn, Holy Spirit. Burn darkness. Bondages. Witchcraft bondages. Bondages. Familiar spirit. Every kind of them. Animals. Dragons. Lord, Father. The missile from heaven. Yes. Hey. Missile from heaven. Here came a shot. Yes, Lord. Rise. Strike a pan. Destroy dragons. Giant strong men. Strong women. Darkness. Wickedness. Satanic evil demons. Following the children of God. Rainy Holy Ghost. Search and destroy scatterbed. Come out from the children of God. Out in their families, their lives. Release their breakthrough. Take your big breakthrough. Receive your breakthrough. I break that wicked hand. Receive your breakthrough. Your anointing from heaven. Fall on top of them. Anointing be revived. The grace that is so sufficient. Fall on top of your children. Glory. Power on top of your children. Glory, power fall on top of your children. Glory, power restored, be restored on top of your children. Anointing from heaven, power, glory, the light of God fall on top of your children. The grace that is so sufficient, locate your children. 
heavenly grace fall down. Anointing, fill thy head, let thy head overflow until to the sole of the feet. Anointing, power, glory, the light of God, say to your children, glory from heaven, restore your children in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, Lord. I release the sword of the Spirit. The sword of the Spirit. As you await, Lord, and in us to read it. Sword of the Spirit. In our children's hearts. In order to conquer darkness. In order, Lord, to finish 2023 with a grace and power and favor from heaven. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Wisdom like Solomon. Be revived over over in the other side when you are sleeping. More wisdom to be above darkness and principalities when you are sleeping. More wisdom in the mighty name of Jesus Christ to pass every blockages. When you see blockages, let it be a small thing in your eyes. Pass and go to the next level. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, the light of God may, must guide you. The light of God to destroy all, all linkage. Of darkness, spiritual husband, spiritual wise, fire. May your crown continue to total destroy. As soon as you connect to the children of God, Father, I declare more fire in the heart, more fire in the body, more fire in the brain that could be feel, be felt only by the demons and serpents, spiritual husband, wives, so that they shall never stay in their body. Let our body become too old to contain by darkness and principalities. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, let the light burn double. The Holy Ghost fire rain like rain. Disconnect all the principalities. Enough is enough. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I release that breakthrough. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, possess your breakthrough. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, Possess your breakthrough and the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Possess your healing and the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Be healed. Possess your breakthrough, your destiny, and the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Destiny help us. Locate my people and the mighty name of Jesus Christ. The light of God to follow them. Darkness be quenched and the mighty name of Jesus Christ. I cover you with the blood. The blood of Jesus. Blood flow. Blood burn backwardness. Roast stagnancy. Backwardness limitation and progress. Blood of Jesus. Destroy it. And go back to our children Lord. And soak them. From head to two with the blood. Bless them when they go out. And when they come in. And the boss flu system. Burn every stranger's. Movement in their bodies with the blood. The blood of Jesus is fiery. It is a stronghold. Burn and search and destroy. Flush out poison. The blood of Jesus. I evolve the power of the blood and the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Thank you, children of God. It is done. Our Father is listening. Our Father loves you. Continue to pray Him, to praise Him, worship Him, read His word. Make a good relationship with him, for it's not far. He loves you more than yourself. May the God Almighty protect you until we meet on Thursday. Shalom.